Professor Spangler and classmates. My name is Laura Patricia Reina Martelet, and I'll be introducing the topic of how to adapt to campus life at ASUCQ. Well, we all know that coming to college at ASUCQ means that we have to make new friendships, get to know a new environment, start a new academic career, and learn how to adjust to living on campus are some of the things that college students must deal with. There are many scary emotions about moving away from home, and there are different obstacles and challenges that one, one has to overcome in order to succeed. The focus and problem of this presentation are that many students have different kinds of problems with adapting, such as stress, food, problems, perspective, health issues, financial issues, and distractions. To achieve the outcome desired, the process of getting the information was based on primary and secondary research. So first, we started with the secondary research, and it was based on supporting evidence that explained why adapting to campus and concentrating is so difficult. Then was the primary research. A survey of 20 questions was launched to the student body and the results indicated what outcome was going to be taking place and what strategies should better for the solution of this report. And I hope you liked the video and enjoyed the presentation. Thank you. To start, it is important to say that adult duties in college include balancing schoolwork, potential employment, and social life. Also, living in any space where students have to constantly be around other students, professors, in a different living environment can affect their performance, not only academically speaking, but socially, mentally, and physically as well. In Arkansas State University, Campus Querétaro, ASUCQ, students have to adapt to a whole new environment because they are not in the home anymore. Having to adapt to meal time, classes, social life, and physical activities all on their own can be very overwhelming and stressful as well. So, now let's talk about the living learning community. According to Wang, 2020, a college student experience is shaped by his or her feeling of community. They have a sense of belonging, a sense that members matter to one another and to the group, and a common belief that members' needs will be satisfied. So having social life or being involved with the living learning community is a factor that influences college experience, since hanging out with friends and feeling like oneself is not alone is important for focusing on academics and personal achievement. This factor is associated with the academic area, and this area is associated with completing your degree. A sense of belonging is essential for mental well-being so if a student does not feel that they belong, it will affect not only their performance in class, but its performance with the physical and mental health. So let's talk about another factor that affects adapting to campus. Being self-efficient when moving away from home is critical for surviving because people have to do laundry, clean the room, drive themselves to school, or have to solve problems. And an article written by Mayors and Escoba in 2018 stated that for most students, those processes such as campus activity and registration and the expectations are difficult when before college, people do not have to do this by themselves. So all of these can affect and cause severe consequences such as emotional excitation or pulling oneself away from friends, and even worse, dropping out of a course or university. Furthermore, when living on campus, there are issues such as lousy residents, being far from the city of Querétaro and going to parties that affect the student's performance. Well, dorm rooms are frequently the last choice for students who want to study because of loud partying, distracting sounds, or roommate issues. An example of that is that while one roommate may have a meeting the next day, the other roommate may have nothing to do except having free time. And the roommate might want to turn on the music, invite some friends over, or party all night.
So throughout this report and presentation, we learned that students have to cope with many emotions and situations that before college they didn't deal with. And it is important to learn and comprehend to help students make college life and adapt to campus easier. And a way to make this process effortless is the primary research. A survey was launched with 20 questions to 20 people from ASUCQ, and with those answers, the problems will be identified and a solution found. Now, let's talk about the first graph. What do you like less about living on campus? 62% of the participants selected the cafeteria, and the less popular result with 2% was the living learning community. This means that a problem that is causing most students to dislike living on campus is the food given and the way that it is made. And all of this because they don't have the nutritional values that are enough for the consumers. Let's analyze graph two. It can be appreciated that the area that affects negatively the most the students living on campus is the mental area with 41%. This is because being mentally unstable can affect a student's performance in every aspect of his or her life, meaning that adapting to campus for them will, be, will not be easier because they are missing stability. In this graph, we asked the participants what they would rather, and with 40%, they answered live outside campus with roomies. The problem here is that all the factors that affect living on campus, such as a cafeteria food or their residence conditions, are making people rather live outside campus. These kinds of changes have to be made by the university. Now, we can observe that in the graph, what was your first perception before living on campus? The three most popular answers were a great environment among students with 23%, residents in good conditions with 22%, and lastly, with 13% was great food cafeteria. These are perceptions that students had before coming to live on campus at ASUCQ, but sadly, these are one of the main factors for why students want to live off campus. Now, in the graph, what is your perception currently? They were asked to select what changed in their perception of campus. And the three most popular answers were bad treasury office, bad food cafeteria, and bad administration office. The problems that are causing students to not be able to adapt are internal elements that the institution, in this case, is responsible for changing. The process of adjusting to life at ASUCQ is influenced by elements such as self-efficiency and living circumstances. These sort of things might have a wide range of effects, but it's crucial to recognize them to come up with a solution. The technique of gathering the material was based on primary and secondary research to obtain the intended result. And there are many solutions to this problem, such as student changing strategies or going to conference and changing things such as residence conditions or food cafeteria. So now let's talk about suggestions and recommendations. One suggestion is going to conference and talks to develop autonomy when doing things. Another one is to communicate all your emotions and thoughts because students have to understand that they're not alone and there might be people that are going through the same thing. And finally, be open to meeting people and getting help. That will help with adapting to campus and every aspect of a student's life. Now, for the institution, some changes are going to help them and the students to adapt to campus is to implement more activities inside the campus so people get more involved. Another one is change the condition of the building such as residence because with time things get deteriorated and people do not feel comfortable if they have problems with the place that they live in. And finally, most students are having trouble with the food in the cafeteria and it can be wise to change the menu and give positive comments to the staff to improve the supplements and menu. Thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed the video.